founder, the guy behind Chapter House Comics. Farouk, how are you doing today? I am very well. How are you? I am excellent. So what drew you to create this excellent publisher and bring on some amazing Canadian talent? It's one of those things uh, I kind of fell into Captain Canuck. Uh, I have a restaurant in downtown Toronto called the Lakeview Restaurant. Great food. Awesome. And uh, I called the Pimo Bacon Sandwich to Captain Canuck. And then it came time for a kid's menu, so I got in touch with Richard Comley, who's the creator of Captain Canuck. So we started to talk and ended up licensing Captain Canuck to me. And then it kind of all took off from there. We started an animated series. Uh, and then um, it came time to publish the comic. And so we shopped it around. And then we were thinking about image. We were thinking about IDW. And we started to get a lot of answers back and that sort of thing. And then we just said, you know what? We should do this ourselves. And not only should we do this ourselves, because Obviously, once, once you start to come to cons, as you know, you start to meet all of these incredible people. And of course, like there's something in the water as far as Canada is concerned because our artists are just phenomenal and we just got such great talent. So everybody was sort of like, oh wow, you know, we kind of want to kind of start to become a part of this. Is it possible? And so people would start to ask. And so obviously there was just a need that it started to fill as far as, uh, you know, people coming and then us just representing them and then kind of you know, uh, putting together an actual, the first, the, the, well, not the first, but like we would like to be Canada's comic book company for sure. You know? And I love it. I'm, I'm personally a huge fan. I've been going to these cons for years and I've, my favorite part is the Artist Alley where you can see the amazing homegrown talent, the out of the box, just unreal ideas that they come up with the amount of dedication and effort that they put into this work and you know a lot of people publish them themselves they do it online and that's a huge job for them to do as well as be an artist be a writer um, and after the Captain Canuck came out there's been some really good Canadian anthologies like True Patriot and Toronto Comics mm -hmm. so it's really amazing to see a publisher really taking these guys seriously putting putting their stuff together you're, you're letting them do the stuff they want to yeah. do and then put you know helping them reach out to a wider market so it's really awesome to see you bring the new talent to the stage but also I hear you're bringing back some of the old Canadian comics yeah so that's kind of been one of our things is that with Captain Canuck I started to have the I started to get the idea with Chapter House to actually bring back some of the old guys like Northgard. There is also Mr. Monster we're bringing back with uh, through Rachel Ritchie, uh, Johnny Canuck as well. Um, and so basically all of these all of these characters are going to become a part of the universe, of the Chapter House universe, that there is a classic universe and then there is a brand new universe that we've sort of developed. That's so amazing. Yeah. I'm I'm geeking out a little bit right here because... I, you know, seeing Captain Canuck brought back was like treat enough, but now we got this extended universe of Canadian comics with our old stuff and our new stuff. I was just over there and I was talking to uh, Fred and Jason Liu and they're doing a crossover and I'm really excited for that. Now we're going to have our own Secret Wars. Uh, what, what's the spread going to be like that? You said it's going to be mainly in Captain Canuck. Are we going to have many of like the one-off issues, or is it going to be more easy to follow than some of our uh, bigger DC, Marvel, yeah. universe-wide crossovers? It's a great question, because that's that's something that, it's still in development, but kind of like what we've all, <coughs> excuse me, what we've all agreed on was, do you remember Secret Wars 2? Where you could, you could buy the crossovers, but they're not important to the story. There was a nine issue, nine issue series. And so I think that's what we're sort of tending towards, so that you could actually buy the two and get it all, uh, buy just Captain Canuck and get them, get it all. And then if you want, there are these crossovers that sort of end up happening. Sort of like extra, extra scenes, sort extra of behind scenes, the footage exactly, or yeah. leading up to, but not super integral to the main plot exactly. line. You can play, you know, you can play the video game, the storyline, but you don't have to collect all of Riddler's Your side quest. You know, the side quest, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> That's excellent, yeah. and it's really awesome to see someone uh, really appreciating Canadian talent, celebrating it old and new. So uh, we're going to look out for Chapter House Comics. 
in our previews catalogs and at conventions like this. Are you guys going to a lot of shows? We are going to a lot of shows. We're actually throughout Canada. In 2017, we've got a ridiculous schedule. Um, yeah, we're doing quite a few shows. At least, I think it's I think it's in and around 30 throughout the year. Wow. Yeah. And so some of the viewers that might be watching might be uh, budding talent of their own uh are you guys interested in having uh independent artists reach out to you and looking to do some canadian comics with chapter house 100 percent. so the idea behind that is is that we take a look at finished work um pitches are pitches you know they're great we'd love to see them of course and we, we totally help out say hey well, this might work this might not work et cetera, et cetera, and guide you along with it Ultimately, it's finished work, and then, you know, we all kind of take a look at it, and we sort of judge what ends up coming through. And that's it, yeah. That's awesome. That's so there's, uh, there's opportunities for Canadian comics creators here at Chapter House, and that's awesome. So thank you so much for contributing to our Canadian comics landscape, and we look forward to seeing your comics in stores and you guys at conventions. And thanks for reporting on it. <laughs>